Hi, I'm Dr. Ricardo Rodriguez and today I want to talk to you about alternatives to a facelift to make your face look younger. Well, the first ones most people think about are laser and nowadays fat grafting. I'm going to tell you a little bit about my experience with laser. Laser is a destructive technique. You aim a beam of energy at the skin and it literally vaporizes the skin layer. Now, some lasers go more superficial, some go deeper, but the basic thing is they vaporize the tissues. The modern lasers are a little bit better in that they just vaporize the tissue in a little column, leaving normal tissues in between, which then heal. That healing is done by SCAR. The laser companies will tell you that there's a lot more deposition of collagen, but that collagen really, what it is, is a SCAR. Now, SCARs, like all scars, will remodel over a period of time and get softer. And what you will see in the real clinical case of the face is that over a period of time, the face will relax and you will lose the effects of the laser. Another problem that I have with the laser is that it destroys part of the dermis. And that's a very complex structure that is very difficult to regenerate. I have a picture of a patient who had a facelift done with laser and she lost some weight and the structure of the dermis collapsed and she had a lot of very fine wrinkles uh, which were not really correctable by more laser that would have thinned out the dermis even more. Uh, what I ended up doing with that patient was rescuing her with a fat graft. Why do fat grafts work? Well, the fat, grafts, the fat grafts themselves have stem cells in them and the stem cells are a regenerative tissue. You see, unlike the laser, which is a destructive tissue, which then your body then comes back in to regenerate, the fat grafts themselves gives you right away structure and then you get regenerative cells that know what to do. The cells will develop into blood vessels or they will develop into structure. They have even been shown experimentally to develop into the kind of sweat glands and oil glands in the skin that help keep that shiny luster of youth in your face. So the fat graft to me is a much more comprehensive answer which has the beauty of being a regenerative answer rather than a destructive answer. Um, I'd like to show you this case of a patient who had acne. In the past, I would have treated this case with laser. However, having the opportunity to inject graft, we did fat grafts in her. Uh, the results are permanent. I last saw her um, two or three years after surgery, and she had the same results as, if, as after four months after surgery. Um, the skin, however, looked really so much better. The patient told me that she wore makeup much less often because her skin was so much better. Uh, in short, I will tell you that I would much rather use fat grafting nowadays to make the face look younger because it actually makes the face younger. Thank you very much for listening to our blog and uh, keep tuned for more.